When you think of elite and exclusive restaurants, you typically do not think of airport dining. But hidden inside Newark Liberty International Airport is one of the trendiest and hard to get into restaurants. United Airlines teamed up with the hospitality group OTG to create the classified dining experience. And Chris Van Cleve scored an invitation to show us around. Good morning. The people walking through Terminal C here at Newark Airport have no idea they're walking right by one of the most sought after restaurants in all of the New York area. We can't show you where it is because it's hidden on purpose, but we will be able to take you inside. Through this door and down this secret hallway, a speakeasy meets fine dining. It's classified. Here, your taste buds will delight if you can score an invite. You want to have the salmon? The invite-only restaurant has just 36 seats and is just steps from your gate. Its exclusive guest list boasts CEOs and celebrities like Madonna. It's very much like New York. It's, you know, secret. I actually had to take a little bit of time to find it. Um, the hostess was very discreet, so I felt very special. United frequent flyer Bree Morrow was one of the first invited to make a reservation. I just had oysters and I'm eating a very fresh salad with shrimp, so I appreciate being able to have a healthy meal with a nice glass of wine. The menu and wine list rivals anything you'd see at a trendy New York City restaurant and can easily set you back $100 a person. That's if you don't order a $500 plus dollar bottle of wine. It's an oasis inside a restaurant inside an airport. James Beard award-winning chef Nate Appleman is the VP of Culinary for OTG, the restaurant company that teamed with United Airlines to turn this mostly forgotten meeting room into classified. We talked with Nate as he prepared a 42-ounce tomahawk steak, one of their signature dishes. Most airports have pre-packaged food that's been cooked before and somebody's just heating it in a microwave. Here, we're actually cooking from scratch. We're using great product and you can't find that anywhere. It is an unusual business plan to create a restaurant that people don't know where it is and have to be invited into. Well, isn't that a lot of fun even just saying that? Rick Blatstein is OTG's CEO. Cheers. We wanted to create a really unique space that's kind of out of the way, a little bit of speakeasiest way to get to, but somewhere where you can just enjoy a great meal, listen to some nice music, have a delicious glass of wine, Take it easy, get yourself away from everything else. People don't think of Newark Airport as a spot for trendy dining. They don't, but they soon will. Rick Hoefling is a United Vice President. The airline looks at classified as a way to surprise and delight. But just who gets invited? Well... There's not just one perspective or one way we look at the invitation list, but it, right now it is classified and it does remain a secret. Was the idea to create one of the elite restaurants in New York here in the New York airport? We didn't set out to make the most elite restaurant and most difficult to get into, but it, it kind of worked out that way. So this is your ticket inside, the email invitation. United says for the flyers who haven't gotten one yet, they can request to be invited to classified, but they won't say how long the wait list is. Our Chris Van Cleve there. I have not gotten, I just checked, have not gotten <laughs> no, my email no, invitation yet. I. So my big pet peeve with restaurants at airports is that they don't have bathrooms inside the restaurant. You were saying so that's that. my one question. <laughs> I've been watching this. I'm like, do you have to go out to the actual airport to go to the bathroom? Because they don't. If, yeah. don't. if classified has one, then you'll love yes. it. But the thing, I would hope that they at least help you get through security. I mean, you already have a lot of time spent at the airport. It'd be good if that reservation or that invite came with a little help. Uh, yes, although as a frequent traveler, anything that sort of ups the game is certainly appreciated. That steak looked good. Yeah, it did. <laughs>